Hello everyone, welcome back to the journey to 2000. We're currently at 1965, just 35 more ELO away, which is really just three wins away uh, if one of the opponents is higher rated than me. It's only three wins away, which is very doable. Even if we get a couple losses, like it's, this is not so bad. We're, we're basically in the end game. So let's get into a 10 minute uh, game. We're gonna get black, of course. Oh my God, we get white, let's go. Okay, this person created their account almost exactly eight years ago. <laughs> Jesus, they have 14,000 wins. That's crazy, and 13,000 losses. They must be very well versed in the carol then. See, that's already a bad move. That's already a bad move, and I'm already up plus 1.6, I want to say. 1.6, 1.7, something like that. Yeah, so they did not play this correctly. Ah, that was not a good move. That was not a good move by me. Yeah, yeah not a good move. That was, that was stupid of me to play that move. But uh, that's okay. It's okay. Yeah, I just realized. Yeah, bam, bam. So we're going to take like this and just uh, not be doing great in terms of our pawn structure. But that's okay. <laughs> I was criticizing my opponent for playing this poorly, and then I then immediately played it poorly. Here. Yeah, this is an interesting position. Already, I kind of want to do this and just not castle. Let's do this. Just blitzes that move out. I'm assuming they maybe want to do something like this. Let's castle. Might see one of these moves. And this is an opposite side castling position where I can support this pawn very well. I can start pushing this pawn. I already have a pawn that I can just immediately start shoving forward, which I could do. They come in. Don't really want to deal with that. Maybe they bring a rook to the fold. I could see them doing this. Um, definitely see them doing that because I can't push because this is it multiple ways. <laughs> We're going to push this pawn. They do this, we jump in here. Oh, I want to set up some sacrifices. I really want to set up some sacrifices, but I don't know what works and what doesn't just yet. Um, also, I should go ahead and mention what my favorite Pokemon is, because I know some of you are absolutely dying to know. Um, I would have accepted two answers. So nobody got it. So nobody got the, gets the $10. Um, I would have accepted two answers. Snorlax and Gengar. So, yeah. Sucks to suck, y'all. Maybe I'll do something like that in the future. Yeah, just this and this seems very nice for me. EBH. Um... Yeah, I don't know why I like those ones so much, but uh, the heart wants what the heart wants, you know what I'm saying? It just wants what it wants. There's no sacrifices. This can just do this, which maybe that's not so good, but, you know, it's something. These knights are just terrible. Like, these knights are just out of the game. They have nowhere to go, nowhere to go. And then once this queen moves, I will hopefully be able to push this. I mean, I'm not sure. Not sure. So the question is, is can I take that? Is that like actually a free pawn? Because I'm not 100% certain. It's takes, takes, takes. Mm. It's a lot of counter. It's a lot of... I mean, um, my king is also lined up, so I really want to just continue with this, but that really ruins my structure. So I say we take a free pawn. If 
We get nine points if we win this game. I didn't even realize my opponent was 1992. Let's look at their peak. If they have 14, th how many games do they have? They have 30,000 games and they have a peak of 2042 as of just, just a couple days ago. Yeah, so I figured they would take with the Rook here. So, I mean, I could do a lot of things. I could do this. They come back here. So here, 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 here. This doesn't work because this comes with check because I was thinking, ooh, maybe I'd be able to do this, but it doesn't work, unfortunately. It doesn't work. I mean, what's wrong with this? What's, 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 what's wrong with just queen takes? Like, I don't, you know. Like GG, you, you you get a little attack for like two seconds. Like I don't I don't see what the hullabaloo is about. Okay, <laughs> I mean fair play. I guess like I don't know what that achieves. Makes you feel good. I guess you get you get the only open file. That's fair. Yeah. And um. Uh, ooh, that seems really nice. Here, here, take this pawn. Mm. That seems really nice for me, actually. I know it opens up the bishop, but if they take and I take here, I just feel like they're going to get bamboozled and destroyed. Okay, bamboozled isn't the right word. <laughs> I said bamboozled and destroyed. Here they just take and I'm... Yeah, I'm going to go for this. I'm going to go for this. I don't think that's the right move, but I'm going to go for it. They have to do something because obviously their knight is hanging. I guess they could do this. I <laughs> guess they could, yeah, but here, 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 here. Oh, my God. This has to be losing for them, I swear. It has to be. Here, they have to, they just have to take, yeah. Check. Maybe they just get out of the way. That'd be very surprising. Is it? I just want to do this now. Or even just this. Yeah, just hold on. Here, how does he continue to protect this bond? Yeah, I'm just going to go here and hit this twice now. Uh huh. Okay, well, I'm winning now, which is pretty nice for me. Hog. But it's kind of hard to here and here. They just do this. Mm. Could look to maybe do this. I would be allowing some checks, though. No, I wouldn't. I mean, here, what if they just push? Then I... Oh. So my candidate moves are to take, and they're obviously going to take like this because this would lead to probably checkmate. I can't go anywhere on this diagonal, so it's a no-go. Yeah, I really want to do this. This seems like the right move. Seems like the right move to me. And if they take, obviously, like, I'm just winning because I'd be hitting this twice. I'm assuming they would block with the queen. Maybe they'd block with this. Maybe they'd block with that. Here, here. They do this. Oh, you know what I could have done is maybe this, go away this, and then give a check at this distance. Maybe that could have been good. We'll check with the engine later. We'll check with the engine later. I also should remember, you know, I have four minutes, they have six and a half. I don't have to like have a checkmating attack. Like I'm up material, so I don't have to find a checkmate. This is something I talked about in a previous video, a couple of uh...
I mean, I, <laughs> I say that and immediately my first mind is like, just sacrifices. Check. This just wins material, yeah? Like, this wins material, I think. Oh my god, they have checkmate soon or close to it, so I need to be careful. I need to be careful. Yeah, I need to not allow any of them shenanigans, which I did not see this check, which is pretty dangerous check. I mean, here, here, yeah, I can't allow that. Then here they take this, so I've, I've. Oh my God, but here they're gonna give this check, which is kind of scary. Yeah, I should have taken or something or like, uh, you know. I mean, here, I can't, yeah, I can't do this, obviously. Okay, here. No more checks or anything, luckily. Well, I'll, be, I'll take like this. I just said I shouldn't like, you know, find a checkmate or something. I should just play safe and I immediately stopped playing safe. <laughs> like immediately. <laughs> Part of my problem is my rook needs to be like on this back rank, so I'll have maybe ideas to do. I don't even know what. Maybe this to come here to get my queen and the rook on the same diagonal is an idea. This is such an innocuous move. Oh, it looks like it's just trying to grab a pawn, but no. You could take that. Going to do this to come here now. Should I do this? Is that kind of a stupid move? So here, if they take like this, I win the queen. But here they take, I take here. Oh, sorry. Here. They'll take. I take. They take. And that's losing for me. So I can't do that, I don't think. Threatening this now again. I hope I didn't just blunder. I think they have to trade. I think they have to. I'd be very surprised if they didn't. Yeah, this is just winning now. Uh huh. Ah, oh, shoot. That was stupid of me. Immediately allowed a check. I mean, it's not a scary check or anything. I can just stay on some light squares and I'll be fine. I'll be fine for the rest of this game. Can't come here. My light squared bishop is really doing well here. And I have ideas to sack, sack, and then do this. So I think he needs to do something about that. I'm worried he's just going to move this, though, or something. That would be a really annoying. Wow, good move, because here, here, and uh, no sack. No sack, your honor. Ugh, good move. Good move by him, to be fair. Mm. 
Maybe this to attack this, I imagine, might be a thing. Yeah, that would just win on here on the side of the board. Not great, not great conversion by me. Yeah, just immediately I notice it. <laughs> um, let's do this. Oh my god. How did I blunder so poorly? Dude. How the heck did I do that? Just didn't even see that fork. <laughs> I'm throwing. I still think I'm going to win this game though. I think. We'll see. Ah, uh, it might be more of a draw, though. So here, here, I take here. That's such a tough call. I'm taking this pawn. Okay, now he messed up. Now he messed up. He can't come back here, and I can push. He messed up, I think. I guess he could try pushing, but I'd just do this, and then... Yeah, push. Here. He comes here, I do this, and I win. I win, I win, I win, I win. Or even if he pushes, does this, I could just do this. Or if push, I could give a check first, which is actually just checkmate. You only got two squares, buddy. <laughs> From the... Let's go! 1974. So here's the thing, guys. That was a fun game. And uh, I'm not entirely sure I deserve to win it, but we did win it. Yeah, I just got... Comp I got f that night fork. Night forks, I think you should never resign when you have a knight. Never, ever resign when you have a knight. So... Yeah, my opponent immediately took, which made me think they know like mainline, you know, fantasy stuff, but this is immediately a bad move. I've seen this so many times and it's already plus 1.6, as I said before. Yeah, literally plus 1.57 if you give the time, the engine some time. Let's go, 1974. Oh, let's go. We got nine points for that game. So the, the reason that I said in the game... There was something I wanted to mention before. I don't even remember. The reason that I said this was a bad move was because you want to buy time and see where this bishop will go first. So I'll do this, and they have to commit their bishop at some point. Oh, wow, it already gives black into... Oh, okay, I wouldn't develop my bishop there, but I would do random stuff like, you know, yada, yada, whatever. It's this. Then they develop... Okay, I guess it's fine to... I always... I've watched a couple of fantasy videos from Danya Narditsky, and I remember in one of them... He said not to commit this knight just yet because then it'll give a bishop just a natural square to develop to. But that's not what you want. It's fine though. Um, you want to make it so it's like somewhere kind of random. Because if they then come here, or I guess, say, fine. I guess they did that, whatever. I won't show any more of the variations. I was, yeah, I have to take like that. I messed up. But this is still winning, plus 2.3. I didn't really evaluate it as such, but I kind of felt like I was doing pretty well here. So best, not best, what's best? See, I didn't really consider that. I don't know why. 
Pushing is so strong. Look at this pawn center. These pawns are never going anywhere. You do this, oh, it's over for you. It's literally over. And if you do this, it's even more over for you. Oh, look at that. Well, I guess, what does it want? Yeah, it wants d6, but in the event of this, what does it want? Oh, okay, that just gives a pawn, but fine, whatever. I, I probably would have seen that if I had more time. Or like if I, you know, just thought about it in the game. I'm kind of just analyzing things really quickly right now. So best, best, bam, bam, here. Some of these, sometimes these innocuous just pawn sacrifices are just low key the best move. Like just sack a pawn, and if they take queen here and it's plus plus five plus six, you're gonna bring your rook here. It's super hard to defend this. Oh, you have you. It said give up your knight. It said just take the knight. You have to sacrifice your knight, and then this is maybe not a good move because of just mate in one. So don't do that. Um, but here. So it said mate in one. Oh, okay, bam. So mate in two. Fine. You 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 wouldn't do this. You'd probably do something like this, I imagine. Okay, that's just, okay. Fine. I would have thought this through in the game. What does it want here? Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Fair move. You have to sack the rook. And this move doesn't work anymore. Oh, because just everything is defended. You don't really have any more good checks. Queen F2 is the best check, and then what? Bishop here. Wow, nice. That's gangster. I'm so happy. Like, just kind of sidestepping all the stuff that's happening in this position. Could push this, could develop the bishop, could sack a knight for no reason. Just this innocuous e6 move. I, 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 lo I love those kind of best moves. It's so hard to, like, the best. Best again. Best. They have to sacrifice, which I did not need to take there. What is it? Oh, it wants this, this, and probably this, yeah. So hold on, sorry. So this is the best move. Where does the where does the knight go? It, it said don't go anywhere. It says you have to sack. You, you have to lose the knight. Best, dude. Stockfish is a gangster. It says you can't even take back. Cause what if you take back? What? Ah, uh, okay. Well, another best move, baby. I spent I spent a minute I spent one full minute on this move because I was like, do I want to take first and then do this? Which I kind of regretted later. I kind of thought, okay, maybe it was better to take, reduce the amount of stuff on the board. When you're in a winning position, if you can't find checkmate, just start boiling things down to a winning endgame where you know you're up. I have three on two here. I can start mobilizing my rook to come over and just start eating these pawns. It's um, but that's a very nice best move. Best. So I didn't love some of these moves. Okay. So I said this was best. And then what was my best move? Or sorry, okay, their best move was this. And then what was my best move? Oh, just to, you know what, that's very true. Yeah, just 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 literally set, just boil things down to a winning end game. Yeah. I made things slightly more complicated. Ooh, look at that. Another nice best move. Just threatening, just threatening rook f1. And if they had just done this, yeah, rook f1 just wins the queen. It's the best move. So so I said blacking here, I just didn't want to like, because here, here, and I guess here, and they have nothing. Bishop d4, counterattacking, so you don't have time for this. I probably just would have done what? This this probably is what I would have done, maybe, in the game. Yeah, rook f, uh, queen f1 is the best move. Okay. Takes, takes. There, there, there. Best. Look at these best moves, baby. I'm telling y'all, I'm in the zone. I'm going to hit 2,000 soon. In the next couple weeks, I think I'm going to hit it. So that is such a nice move. If they had simply like done, I don't know, this. Yeah, rook takes g7 is the best move because takes, takes, and this is obviously, they have no hope here. They literally have no hope here. Um, but they played a good move, which was to defend this so that, you know, if I do sack, this doesn't win anything. Uh, you can't take. Yeah, I, I messed up there. Best, best, best. And <laughs> like I said, just these knight forks. They spent 20 seconds here. They didn't take the, yeah, it was, yeah, was there a way for me to, yeah, there wasn't a way for me to continue to defend my bishop, unfortunately. So best here. And this is a draw? Because of what? This is what I thought, okay. Oh, it's because this move threatens checkmate. Yeah, this move threatens checkmate. Yeah, yeah. They have to give this check. Or sorry, they have to do this. 
Or I guess it is a check. Do that. And then here so that you can't come here. That's crazy. That's really good calculation. Wow. Here. And this is a draw because of why. Because you block with the knight and simultaneously give a check. And you win this in the... Oh my god, that's so tough. That's so tough. Oh, I guess... Okay, sorry. That was stupid of me. You can't do that. And this is a draw. Here looks scary. But then just here and you have nothing. It says h4 is my best move here. But what if just here? Oh, you get forked. Oh my god. Oh, even if you do... Even if you do give the fork... Yeah, they... they oh, that's all right. Am I high? Why did I think this was a fork? Am I stupid? Anyway, okay. That's crazy endgame stuff. You know, I, I was kind of low time as per usual. Bam. Best move. Yeah, they don't. They have to go here, at which point I probably would have done this. Yeah, best move. And then what do they have? They just have here, yeah. So they don't get checkmated. And then here I would probably just sack and push this pawn. Let's go, baby. Nice win with the fantasy. Haro Khan. Oh, yeah. Yeah, if you ever face the fantasy, don't. Do not take take and play knight f3. Knight f6. It looks like such an innocuous, normal kind of developing move, but you get bullied. These are the best moves for a reason because you just take the whole center. This knight is in jail for the rest of its life. This knight also. These knights sucked for the rest of the game. Look at these knights. These knights were terrible. These knights did absolutely nothing the whole game. They did nothing. Yeah, okay, you captured a pawn. Okay, one of the knights ended up being a crucial piece in the end game, but eh, whatever. There's an end game they lost, so it's not crucial to me. Let's go. Nice. Well, we got the win. We have 26 more ELO until we get to 2000. Wait. Is it 26? 8, 6, 8, 16, 24. Okay, now it's three more wins. I don't know why I thought it was three wins before. It's three wins from now. Oh my god, I'm so close to being a 2000. Oh my god, let's go, baby. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, it was a fun game. Um, yeah, I will uh, see you guys on the next one. Take care.